so till now we have seen example of three conversation right these three are very beautiful calls that we can learn many things from it uh, we have two more candidates today yash and sanjeev yash and sanjeev uh, have you seen some of the video lectures from my youtube or this is very first class of you how is this it is the first class okay so uh, actually this is a ongoing session from 25th of april so some of the thing you might not understand have patience you can learn many thing from our recorded lectures also that is available on youtube right and if you are interested to join further classes means if you really want to take the rtr classes then we'll have some special attention about late comers also okay no problem some of the topics that already been discussed with the students you might not understand have patience try to analyze it more and more try to understand from your side okay yes what about you is there anything i can know okay <clears throat> so we'll talk about the call that we did with victor tango kivek fox drop echo okay i had tried two times to make communication with victor tango kivet fox dot echo okay. but in reply we don't receive any response right so you can have a look how it will goes for the example of call i had given a call victor tango kivet fox dot echo bangalore tower how do you read right and in this response <clears throat> we had not received anything okay so how we are going to write here response of nothing you can write as this <clears throat> that clear you should write the word no response you can write in any manner like you may also write like this but you should write this thing no response so that by giving another communication you can assure that victor tango kivet fox trot echo is really not reading you okay <clears throat> why this is important because here you are saying that you have not seen any response from victor tango kivet fox trot echo and if you won't write either you have received a response or not then how you are going to check whether your receiver is working or whether your transmitter is working our reliability check is for our instrument and equipments only that please confirm whether 
I am able to transmit properly to you or whether I am receiving your transmission or not. Okay. So this was a nice example we had with Victor Tango, Quebec, Foxtrot, Echo. Okay. Now, <clears throat> what next? We'll talk about call received from Victor Tango, Hotel Echo, Mike. Okay. In the call of Victor Tango, Hotel Echo, Mike, I had given at very first, like from the receiver and the I received. How we'll write anything from receiver end? In the receiver section only. In the receiver end, I had received Okay. And he asked me, how do you read? And reply, what I had replied, Victor Tango Hotel Echo Mike, read you three, Bangalore Tower. <clears throat> Okay. So he should reply again by saying it. I say again, if he really have some message, then only I say again, Tango Towers, Victor Tango Hotel Echo Mike. How do you read? Okay. The call will go such. First, he asked me for how do you read? In reply, I said radio 3. So, usko ye ensure karna padega. He should transmit many number of times so that the receiver end can receive you till read you 5. ठीक है आपको तब तक मेहनत करनी है कॉल कम्युनिकेशन टिल द टाइम द रिसीवर एंड विल रिसीव आइदर यू 4 और 5 देन ओनली यू शुड लीव योर कॉल टिल द टाइम बाय सेटिंग योर इक्विपमेंट्स बाय सेटिंग योर माइक बाय सेटिंग योर स्पीकर रिसीवर एंड ट्रांसमीटर दिस इज फॉर बोथ रिसीवर and transmitter both can try to manage the situation or tune either receiver transmitter or any equipment so that both can assure the readability is at least four or five five will be best and four also will acceptable sometimes okay so good call with these two examples now further i had received a call from victor tango alpha bravo bravo <coughs> there <coughs> i had given three things the call was such is my screen visible are the forms clear to you or should i increase the font size more Anyone? Fonts are clear to you? These fonts, size of the fonts and all letters. Okay. So I had received a call from Victor Tango Alpha Bravo Bravo. I had given these three things to him. I said him, Primary one, two, three, four. Secondary 
four, three, two, one. And one more thing I had given to him that was visibility two zero zero. And I asked for acknowledgement of visibility only. So he did very good thing. He replied with Bangalore Tower. Richard Tango also Bravo Bravo. That was his call sign. Visibility 200. Why? Because I had asked for the acknowledgement of visibility only. Then I asked again, suppose I did not ask for any kind of acknowledgement. Okay. Acknowledgement was not asked to you. So in the reply, he did very good thing that he had repeated all those data exactly as received. He had repeated Victor. Bangalore Tower, Victor Tango Alpha Bravo Bravo, primary one, two, three, four, secondary four, three, two, one, and visibility two, zero, zero. <clears throat> this is the way we should go ahead. If you find anything not clear to you, and if you don't understand what to do, not to do, give readback of everything, whatever you received. Okay? Give readback of each and everything in the same manner you received. Okay? Aapko primary 1, 2, 3, 4, secondary 4, 3, 2, 1, exactly waise hi bolna hai, jaisa aapko receive ho. Don't try to skip these words primary and secondary. Don't try directly Bangalore Tower, Victor Tango Alpha Bravo Bravo, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1. Because this primary and secondary, we'll, we'll catch this later. This primary and secondary data belongs to HF settings, primary and secondary, HF calls. So anything can be important to you. Whatever you are receiving from ATC, just note it down exactly in the same manner you are receiving and give the read back as per your suitability. If you are well aware about what are the data that can be given as a read back, otherwise reply as you received. Okay. Is there any doubt till the time? I'd like to hear from any of the students. Is that clear till now? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> so, for the readability only, I'm going to make some data that can be read back as minimum requirements of it. Okay. Kon se data ka aapko mandatory read back dena hai in your call. This is mandatory. You can skip some other things, but the data I'm going to write now. You need to give the read back as a mandatory part of it. Okay. So now down. ATC root clearance. If ATC is saying any one of the root to you in your call sign that flight plan from, uh, from Bhopal to Bangalore approved wide route 
seven four five alpha seven four five. This is the all sign of a root. Don't be confused. We'll catch this later. So if you heard, is there any root number in the communication? We should give readback of it as a mandatory. Next, clearance to enter. Where to enter? Enter any airspace. Enter any route. To cross any routes. Such clearance shall be read back as a mandatory. Okay. Next, land on. Land on shall also be given as a mandatory read back. Land on. Where to land on? Any runway. For helicopter, also they are using runway. Sometimes they may ask you to directly follow the taxi way and land directly on apron. So, if it is saying you to land on somewhere, doesn't matter whether it's a runway, taxi way, or apron, you need to give readback of it. If he is saying land on runway 27, so you have to reply to me that confirm will confirm landing on runway 27 and you can end your call with your call sign. We will catch this thing later. Okay. And what else you should give as a mandatory read back? Take off from. Similarly, like he has given you the permission to land on runway so and so, they will give you permission to take off from runway 27. So, you have to go back to the runway taking off from runway 27. Or you can say exactly as you received in an instruction, take off from runway 27. Suppose this is the runway. You are on a taxiway. This is taxiway Bravo. And this is runway holding point. This side runway 27. And this side, what it could be? Any guesses? Minus zero. Minus zero. Zero nine. Okay. We'll catch this later. Don't worry. There is a formula to find the reciprocal of a runway. So they may ask you to either take off from runway two seven. What does it really mean? You should go to the this point. What was this point named? Abhishek, runway ke starting major has portion of the Kya naam hai uska? So runway threshold. Ah, runway threshold. Very good. And you need to take off in this direction. Okay. So, aapko is report ko like ATC jab bhi aapko bole take off from runway two seven. Up Yase Age Badane Sepahele, you should give a call, take off from runway 27, and whatever is your call sign, just end your call with the triangle for Bravo Row. So that if he is saying you to take off from runway 27, by mistake, if you have heard anything or uh, if you have noted anything wrong, 37. Suppose uh, this, uh, this is not a case, you will not find runway 37 and 27 simultaneously or aside of it but you need to confirm the takeoff runway 
as you received. If you say take off from runway 27 as a mandatory read back, you should also say take off from runway 27 and you can end this call. Okay. So the basic requirement is you should give a read back of take off runway as a mandatory read back report. Then any kind of cross. They may ask you to cross some route, cross some taxiway. You should also read it back. Your cross routes. Cross routes means you need to cross some routes. So if you say cross alpha 745 in his communication, you should also give a read back of cross alpha 745 okay as a mandatory read back okay and there are many things we'll catch on later classes how many things that we should actually give as a read back for now it will be a little confusing for you is that okay, everyone? You need to give read back of all those things that you find important with these routes, clearances, any runway number, crossing of any tracks, flight level, altitude, SSR codes, means transponder codes, heading, speed. These are the additional things. Uh, not normally you will receive from ATC. But if these things you are receiving from any ATC, you should give read back of that. Is that okay? Okay. Yes, sir. So these are the things and a very beautiful call we had in our early session of this class. Very beautiful examples we had gone through in the starting of this meeting. We'll take a break of five minutes and post coming to the break, we are going to read the similar layer, uh, previous classes thing, phrases. We had left out to talk about some phrases yesterday. We had I studied about 15 phrases. We'll cover some more. There are not more than 20, 10, 25. We'll cover all those phrases today. And we'll start making call by the use of that phrases. Okay. So we'll take a break of five minutes and we'll return on 2130. Two minutes left in this session and five additional minutes we'll take as a break after the break we are going to read phrases okay everyone any doubt till the time that we had studied yet okay see Silence or no response shall always be understood as everything okay. Or who is giving transmission, he should understand whether all the things are okay or not. If you won't give any response, then it will be understood as okay. That is you also. If you won't give any response, everything will be understood as neutral. Now, whomsoever is making a call, usko samajna padega ki mera transmitter khraab hai ya mera receiver khraab hai. You will not find any kind of assistance from ATC side. Okay? So, okay. We'll meet after break. Take a break of five minutes. Have a water. 
linear drops and come back. Okay. Hi, Rishik. We'll come back. Uh, we'll wait for some more to join. Okay. There's not many of them. Okay, sir. नहीं खाएंगे
हेलो हेलो आई एम ऑन म्यूट राइट यस सर सो नंबर 16 फ्रेज यू कैन राइट एज अ एक्नॉलेज ठीक है नंबर 16 यू कैन राइट एज अ एक्नॉलेज what acknowledge exactly means it means let me know that you have received and understood this message okay acknowledgement means let me know that you have received and understood this message like in the last call with abhishek i had asked him to acknowledge visibility so in any communication if i say acknowledge then he need to give read back of he need to give read back of the message that has been requested to acknowledge theek hai you will find some more phrase that is similar to the acknowledge That's why you need to understand. Acknowledge word कौन बोलेगा? Transmitter and a person. ठीक है? जो message pass कर रहा है, he will use the phrase acknowledge in his communication. ठीक है? Understand? Again, acknowledge is a hint. with that this is a question kind of thing like we had studied about say again right if i say say again it means i am raising a question to receiver that repeat your transmission acknowledgement clear till now any doubt so far in the meaning of acknowledgement no sir now note the next phrase that is roger how to speak this roger don't say roger like you might say this gold you might say this sold but don't say it roger what to say say it roger okay similar to this sorry similar to this one like pronunciation mein isko thoda sa aisa samajhna hai like आप इसको क्या बोलते हो टॉट टी ए यू जी एच टी टॉट सिमिलरली इसको भी रॉजर बोलना है रॉजर डोंट से इट रोजर रोजर मीन्स वट रॉजर मीन्स आई हैव रिसीव्ड ऑल ऑफ योर last transmission okay roger ka use kahan pe karna hai jahan pe aap ye express karna chahte ho okay i had received your transmission aapne jo bola maine usko receive kar liya acknowledge follow it 
these are the later stage of this roger okay aap roger ka use wahan karoge jahan pe aap bas ye express karna chahte ho okay maine aapki baat sun li usko follow karna usko acknowledge karke aage karna that is the secondary things okay now someone might be confused in between roger and acknowledgement theek okay? hai again this is of similar type like it was in say again and i say again if you are saying acknowledge you are questioning receiver to kind give the read back of anything that you want as a read back but if you are saying roger from receiver and you are saying to transmitter okay aapne jo bola maine usko sun liya so this will be used as a answer type is that clear any doubt okay so what does really roger and acknowledgement means theek hai for example this is very critical to show each and every phrase with example because yahi pe thoda thoda confusion start hota hai like in the transmission i had said like runway visual range 200 land on runway 27 and while giving this transmission i might ask acknowledge runway means i am questioning the aircraft ki maine jo aapko runway 27 bola na इसको एक्नोलेज करो गिव मी ए रीड बैक दैट यू हैड रिसीव्ड एंड अंडरस्टूड कि मैंने रनवे टू सेवन बोला है इट मीन्स आपको रनवे टू सेवन पे ही लैंड करना है यू हैड रिसीव्ड इट करेक्टली एंड यू अंडरस्टूड दैट आपको रनवे टू सेवन पे ही लैंड करना है बट इन द केस ऑफ रॉजर आपको अंडरस्टैंडिंग कंप्लाइंस इस पे ध्यान नहीं देना है द रोजर ओनली यू कैन से आई हैड रिसीव दिस मैसेज टू यू सपोज यू आर ऑन टैक्सी वे ब्रावो एंड यू आर गोइंग थ्रू इट इट इज ही आस्क यू कीप गोइंग ऑन टैक्सी वे ब्रावो what he'll say you keep going on taxi way bravo and you are already going aap usko follow kar rahe ho in the reply you can simply say roger okay aapki baat maine sun li comply mai khadi raha okay so this is the use of roger like aapko ATC को आपको बोलना है दैट यू आर ऑन टैक्सी वे बड़ा एटीसी टोल्ड यू दैट टैक्सी वाया टैक्सी वे बड़ा एंड यू आर ऑन टैक्सी वे ब्रावो एंड यू जस्ट इन्फॉर्म द सिचुएशन यू हैव टोल्ड टू एटीसी विच टैंग ब्रावो ब्रावो ऑन टैक्सी वे ब्रावो तो ATC को अब आपके इस इंस्ट्रक्शन से फर्दर कोई ज्यादा प्रॉब्लम या कुछ सजेशन नहीं है उसको इस बात से ओके okay है कि यस यू कैन गो अहेड विथ टैक्सी वे ब्रावो सो इन द रिप्लाई एटीसी विल से यू रॉजर ओके जाओ ठीक है लाइक दिस व्हाट इज सेइंग यस आई हैड रिसीव्ड योर लास्ट ट्रांसमिशन नाउ ओके टू proceed further no problem right
so note down is there any problem while doing the things on roger and acknowledgement till now any problem any no, doubt okay so note down the next phrase that is is my screen visual enough theek hai na note down the next phrase that is will co w y l c o will co will co by the name of it only it is clear that will comply aapne jo bola main usko follow karunga okay by the name of it only it is clear that will comply i understand your messages and will comply with it okay now what does it really mean roger bhi to yahi tha ki i had understood your message i had received your sorry roger tha i had received your message theek hai will go means also i had received your message but the additional thing is you are giving assurance to the transmitter that you will comply with the instructions like on the taxi way bravo only there is example of taxi way bravo right so for the taxi way bravo only you are on right path you are on taxi way bravo if you say that you are on taxi way bravo and if this is okay to the atc they will simply say roger now in addition with this they may ask you roger hold short runway 27 usne is fact ko acknowledge kiya ki that okay you are on taxi bravo now he is also passing you an instruction that hold short runway 27 so in the reply of it you need to say will go first you need to give read back hold short runway 27 will go with the tango alpha bravo bravo okay उसने आपको एक रनवे नंबर दिया रनवे नंबर को आपको एज अ मैंडेटरी रीडबैक देना ही देना है ताकि कोई इम्बिग्विटी नहीं रह जाए आपने रीडबैक दिया होल शॉट रनवे टू सेवन एंड यू सेड विल को ठीक है आपने बोला कि रनवे टू सेवन से पहले रुकना है विल होल्ड आवर शॉर्ट मीन्स हम रनवे टू सेवन से पहले रुक जाएंगे दिस इज इट will go will go means i understood your message will comply with it is that clear everybody any doubt any confusion in between will go and roger no sir now you can note down the next phrase and that is 
maintain what is the next phase for you maintain by the name of itself it is acha for a general life experience if i ask you you are maintaining something what does it really mean you are continuing something as it is you are maintaining your personality means you are continuing your height your weight your hair style such things as you are currently wearing right iska yahi matlab hota hai similarly maintain ka matlab hota hai by the aviation terminology what it really mean continue in accordance with the conditions specified conditions specified aapko jaisa condition specify kiya gaya aap usko follow karte ho aap usko maintain karte ho फॉर एग्जाम्पल समन में आस्क यू मेंटेन अल्फा सेवन फोर फाइव दिस इज रूट यू आर फ्रॉम भोपाल टू बैंगलोर दिस इज द रूट अल्फा फोर सेवन फाइव दे मे आस्क यू मेंटेन फ्लाइट लेवल थ्री सिक्स जीरो मीन्स कीप गोइंग ऑन थर्टी सिक्स थाउजेंड फीट ओके now note down the next phase that will be stand by really in the beginning of call i am using this stand by stand by what does it uh, really stand by means stand by means wait and i will call you so wait and i will call you okay. suppose you are giving a transmission to bangalore tower you said bangalore tower victor tango alpha bravo bravo how do you read okay. you can ask him how do you read but in reply he said you stand by this is the shortcut of stand by you can write it you can use it as a short hand of the phrase stand by okay he told you stand by what does it really mean he is busy in some work or he is not ready to give reply now he asked you to wait for some time he knows that you are calling he will call you after some time okay he knows that you are calling he asked you to wait he will call you back okay is this a stand by clear to you all because this is most used phrase in the aviation okay now next phrase with you is unable 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 by the name of it you can understand what inability means what inability means you cannot 
टू एज रिक्वेस्टेड और एज इंस्ट्रक्टेड बिकॉज ही इज नॉट कैपेबल ऑफ डूइंग मैं आपको बोलूंगा छत से कुछ जब यू आर अनेबल टू जम्प फ्रॉम द रूफ वाई बिकॉज जंपिंग फ्रॉम रूफ इज नॉट सुटेबल टू यू यू माइट हैव सम डैमेज जंपिंग फ्रॉम द रूफ इज नॉट अ गुड आइडिया फॉर यू That's why you are unable to jump from the roof. Okay. So the use of this phrase "unable" means you cannot comply with the instructions. Okay. What does it really mean? I cannot comply with the instructions i cannot comply with the instructions or clearance you told somebody to climb flight level 360 that is 36000 feet but his aircraft is not capable how he will fly so in the reply of that we will say you unable to climb flight level 360 due weight uske aircraft ka weight itna zyada tha ki uska rate of climb kam pad jayega to reach flight level 360 is that okay have you understood the meaning of phrase unable now next one for you report रिपोर्ट का मतलब होता है पास मी द फॉलोइंग मैसेज रिपोर्ट का मतलब पास मी द फॉलोइंग फॉलोइंग मैसेज द एग्जांपल ऑफ इट If you are flying on flight level three six zero, you are following the route Alpha seven four five. ATC asks you to report your altitude. He want to pass. He want you to pass the current altitude. What he'll say? Report flight level. In the reply, you will say flight level three six zero. That's it. Okay, so that was all about report. Another phrase is request. By the name of it, it is very clear. Request का मतलब है you want something to know. ठीक है. So report का मतलब है I wish to obtain. मुझे ये चाहिए और आई शुड लाइक टू नो ठीक है आप किसी चीज को रिक्वेस्ट कर रहे हो आदर आपको वो चाहिए या फिर आप उस चीज को जानना चाहते हो कि क्या है ये द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ इट यू कैन आस्क इट इज सी Request taxi instructions. You can ask your ATC. Request pushback of aircraft. For the pushback pushback of aircraft, 
यू विश टू ऑबटेन आपको करना है पुश बैक आप उसके लिए क्लियरेंस मांग रहे हो यू विश टू ऑबटेन द क्लियरेंस फॉर पुश बैक एंड रिक्वेस्ट इंस्ट्रक्शन टू टैक्सी यू लाइक टू नो बाय फॉलोइंग विच टैक्सी वे यू कैन प्रोसीड फर्दर टू द रन वे ओके सो दिस इज द मीनिंग ऑफ रिक्वेस्ट here in the term of you wish to obtain something or in the term of you would like to know something is this clear to you yes sir now write one more phrase confirm and in the short form of confirm you can write cfm confirm you can write cfm in the short form of it. this is acceptable but don't write as a capital letter you might the examiner might understand anything else how to write cfm this is acceptable way okay. confirm means you want to check something okay but in what manner you want a verification of it you want to validate it okay You want to validate, जैसे मैं बोलूंगा कि दस बजे से क्लास स्टार्ट होगी यू कैन एस सर कन्फर्म मीन्स आप दोबारा से मुझे इस बात की वैलिडेशन दीजिए श्योरिटी दीजिए कि पक्का दस बजे से क्लास स्टार्ट हो जाएगी बट इट सो द मीनिंग ऑफ कन्फर्म इज आई रिक्वेस्ट verification i request validation i request verification of what of clearances i request verification of instructions i request verification of action and i request verification of information क्लियरेंस का आप समझ गए इफ हिल आस्क यू टू प्रोसीड वाया टू टेक ऑफ वाया रनवे टू सेवन यू कैन आस्क कन्फर्म रनवे टू सेवन क्लियर मीन्स यू वॉन्ट हिम टू कन्फर्म वेदर रनवे टू सेवन इज क्लियर और नॉट ठीक है इंस्ट्रक्शन इफ आस्क यू टू प्रोसीड वाया टैक्सी वे ब्रैवो यू कैन आस्क कन्फर्म टैक्सी वे ब्रैवो मीन्स You want him to validate that you are on right track. Confirm your action. If ATC ask you to turn left, so in the question you can ask you confirm left turn. Means confirm कर दो कि मुझे left turn नहीं करना है ना दोबारा से. You are you are needing verification. Confirm left turn as a information. Suppose you had an emergency, you request for the emergency assistance or you request for the firefighting services. So you can ask a DC confirm firefighting services available. You are asking him, "Can you confirm that you have firefighting services heavy or not?" So you are confirming an information. Okay. so this was all about the fresh confirm okay any doubt in the meaning of it no negative keep practicing it from now only saying negative okay some of the phrases i am leaving for now because 
यू वॉन्ट गेट इट नाउ एंड उसके एग्जाम्पल को समझाने के लिए काफी डीप डिस्कशन करना पड़ेगा विल चेक फर्दर ठीक है जब भी उसकी जरूरत पड़ेगी ना उसको उसी टाइम एक्सप्लेन कर देंगे बिकॉज विदाउट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ इट यू वॉन्ट गेट इट बाय द मीनिंग ऑफ इट ठीक है बिना एग्जाम्पल के सिर्फ इसके मीनिंग से आप नहीं समझोगे देन वन मोर पॉपुलर फ्रेज इज गो अहेड ठीक है गो अहेड मीन्स टू प्रोसीड विद योर मैसेज इन दिस ट्रांसमिशन कि आप जो बोलना चाहते हो आप बोलो ठीक है बट दिस हैज बिन ओमिटेड इसको नाइन फोर थ्री टू एक और डॉक्यूमेंट है वहां से ओमिट कर दिया गया है नया प्रोसीजर आया है कि इफ यू आर सेइंग कॉल साइन इन द लास्ट ऑफ योर ट्रांसमिशन इट मीन्स यू आर साइनिंग योर डॉक्यूमेंट लाइक सीबी में जब आपका सीबी सबमिट होता है आप जो कुछ भी उसमें लिखते हो योर एक्सपीरियंस डेटा एंड ऑल लास्ट में बोलता है ना आप साइन कर दो सो दैट यू कैन कंफर्म दिस इंफॉर्मेशन आर ट्रू सिमिलरली कॉल एंड होने के बाद आप अपना कॉल साइन करते हो ठीक है दिस इज इन प्रैक्टिस कि डब्ल्यू टू का जो यूज है रिपीटेटिव कम्युनिकेशन में नॉट जस्ट आफ्टर डब्ल्यू वन यू कैन यूज द डब्ल्यू टू इन लास्ट so that you can sign your call ठीक है अभी भी आपको go ahead का use मिलेगा नहीं भी मिले then that is okay आप बोल दोगे तो भी इस पर कोई निगेटिव मार्किंग नहीं है बट इन द रिप्लाई एग्जाम लास्ट यू कंफर्म इज इट ओमिटेड और नो सो यू शुड से यस इट इज ओमिटेड अभी हटा दिया गया है ठीक है सो विल टेक अ ब्रेक ऑफ फाइव मिनट after the break we'll have some discussion on the call structure that was all about phrases theek okay? hai we'll meet after break and we'll have a discussion on call structure for now take a break of 5 minutes have some water and join us back Okay